we've never really stopped to consider why Blythe is able to understand what we say. Or how? Oh, I think I know. It simply had to be that Blythe was raised by apes. She learned to swing from jungle vines before she could walk. Wild monkeys got her climbing, and she got her social ability from chimps who laugh and grin all day and night. <laughs> Her design skills from my whole simian clan. Oh, and her mind was able to quickly grasp people talk because she was born a human and picked it up like second nature. After she was caught and sold to a zoo. But the zoo got in trouble for exhibiting a small human. And Blythe was soon adopted by a kindly airline pilot on layover who who dabbled in, in zoology in his free time. He needed a daughter because he had a habit of buying up old dollhouses and stuffed animals at yard sales and, <laughs> well, you know, people were starting to talk. The end. Uh, that's some idea you've got there, Minka. Thanks. Anyone else? I see our Blythe as a master conjurer. She understands how to perform a good and convincing illusion. She can talk to us because she also knows how to really listen. A good magician does that, and Blythe is in many ways the best magician I've ever seen. So, how does she do it? The greatest magicians never tell their secrets. That's my theory, and I think it's a good one. Ha! Of course, you think Blythe's a magician, but you are way off. Oh, no! Blythe isn't any sort of magician out to trick us. I think what she does comes down to her one-of-a-kind ability to hear messages inside her head on her own subatomic hearing level from antenna-headed crowds of space beings far out in uh, space. And it's just that simple. See? Blythe alone can translate these weird messages from advanced alien beings, which she uses to help create all her fashion designs so that they come out just slightly beyond average human understanding. It's what ordinary people call the cutting edge. And it's high-minded stuff like that right there, which has caused her to be able to talk to and understand animals in her spare Earth time for her own much-needed mental relaxation. Piece of cake! Which reminds me, I want cake. Why? <laughs>